With everything going on, I haven't had time to buy presents for anyone. Yeah, well, the gift shops in the county jail have the worst selections, don't they? Which is why I didn't get you anything either. Mm. Well, there's always my birthday, Craig. Mm. So, what are the two of you doing for Christmas? Well, that depends on you. <clears throat> I'm spending Christmas with my family. Well, that's good. That's good. Christmas is a time for family. Of course, Bobby and I don't have those kind of attachments and not being married or anything. You were just on your way out, were you, Craig? I am now. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Listen, Kelly, I'll drop by tomorrow, and uh, we can get started on that uh, igloo. Thank you for the seashell house. It's, it's wonderful. Oh, you're very welcome. Have a good Christmas Eve. You too. Good night. Is this the seashell house? Yes. It's cute, isn't oh, it? I think it's really nice, yeah. Um, this isn't exactly what I wanted to give you, but it's close. Robert. Do you like it? It's beautiful. Well, I'm going to have it engraved, but uh, I wouldn't sure what to put on it. I know what I wanted to say, but I didn't know if you wanted to hear it. Maybe we should think about it and, and decide what to put on it. Kelly, we have waited too long to decide too much. Now, I know this isn't going to be easy. But nothing can be harder than waiting like this. I, I don't I don't know what to say to you, Robert. I'm not accustomed to letting fate run its course. I like to make things happen. Now, if that means starting over again, fine. If it means going through a ton of emotional baggage, that's fine too. Whatever it takes. But I can't just let it ride like this. Robert, you act as if I'm supposed to just say poof and, and everything's okay. I can't forget what happened. I can't pretend that it never occurred. And I can't look at you without seeing Quinn. You didn't love him, Kelly. You loved me. Everything that you did with him, you did with me. Every moment that you shared, even the doubts and the fears, that was me, not my brother. Quinn had to become me to win you. Because he knew that the real Quinn didn't have a chance. So he had to impersonate the only man he knew did. The man who you had already fallen in love with once. Now you were about to fall for again. I'm that man, Kelly. When you look at me, don't see Quinn. Don't see Robert. Just see the man you love. And the one who loves you. Nothing's happened to change that. Nothing ever will. And nothing else matters.